They are clearing a lot of bushes here these days. Perfect for riding now. Remember, this is still all part of the upper. Yeah, recently I really try to do the uphills by standing, dancing on my bike, using my own weight and of course the massive power of my arms to gain further forward momentum. And I think long term it's better for your upper thighs and hips not to sit, sit so much on your saddle of course if it's, if it's flat or it's going only slightly up it's okay to sit but if you say you, you want to uh, climb 100 or 200 meters of altitude yeah, I think it's always better not to sit a whole minute on your saddle. Okay, now I've cooled it down a little from this about 200 meter uphill. I think we can start descending right about now yes you've heard me now let's go for the descent the fork is open riders and runners okay you have to keep your momentum it's not a downhill track get some hell strokes in here okay we are on the ridge again the 
Now it's getting tight around those trees. And down again. Okay, here a new section around this ridge. We can tight. So good. Compression. Into another new section. Very tight. This one was not so over eagerly adapted. Maybe because it's going up here. And then no further there, but a U turn to the downside. more paddling into another off camera section really gets you on your toes or on your side shops I have refresh section and luckily I have my fat bike today otherwise more fresh sections compression okay on a low track but right, then again on a new section slight compression heavy compression yeah more, more bump than a compression and Fashion corner Ooh. into a free fall into a massive compression. This one really is a compression. More free country. I guess I'm the only one riding there. Okay, on the old Comma Commander. Sprinting towards the top. Dropping it. Oh, <laughs> nice. The Coma Lone Corners. those cars I sure like them special line We made it alive back down.
guys i really hope you enjoyed the content this was a ride in mont blanc in the val de la coma the trace yeah uh, most of the trace sure some of them were already there most i, I built or maintained so that they can be ridden uh, you've seen coma ridge to coma commando to coma loam to coma half pipe and then down in lai um yeah it's, it's a cool trail about 200 meters of descending and yeah you can do it with a trail bike or you can do it with a fat bike but with a fat bike i think it's the most fun because you can also do something unpredictable there are not so I mean, I mean there are some riders here in Mont Blanc but not lots of them uh, so most trails the fresh ones most of them they are not that paved out by other riders not blown. I think it's a good thing because you have fresh soil especially in Spain where a good um, changeable soil or the impactable soil uh, is, is quite um, it's not quite common some parts of Spain don't even have that at all so yeah and for that a fat bike or a bike with wider tires uh, uh, when I had my tall boy with, with plus tires uh, what was that I think specialized fast track in 2.8 wow. that was sweet also on the narrow trails they are a bit unpredictable of course but you can also can come off of the main tread and you still have the speed and momentum to carry on and yeah to have fun outdoors and yeah trail riding at least here in spain has a bit the taste of road riding and i'm not a big fan of road riding i i prefer nature be engaged with nature and the beautiful optics of nature yeah okay the, the light is not that well today but you can't have them all at least today the the ground the soil was a bit humid so the grip was fantastic so that's it for today guys i hope you enjoyed the content and if you did so please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel until next time, bye bye.